So a couple of months ago, I created some videos regarding Unreal Engine Meta Humans and Deep Face Live. And one of the things that I said about the downside of this technique or this method is that even though you're using Deep Face Live, you're still going to need to drive the facial animation of the Meta Human to feed to the Deep Face Live software. It kind of defeats the purpose of this because you still have to animate the meta human. You can't use your own face. But if you have a helmet like I'm using right now, the FaceGood P1 helmet, this is able to drive the meta human live, as you can see right now with my face. So let me just go ahead and break down what's going on. I have the FaceGood P1 helmet driving the meta human live inside Unreal Engine. And then in Unreal Engine, I have the Deep Face Live deep faking Tom Cruise's face on top of it. Now, when using it this way, there's actually quite a potential for this technology. Now, I've seen a lot of videos about this tech with MetaHumans and Deep Face, but they also they only have all the animations pretty much in the MetaHuman creator. Well, this right here is actually taking it one step further because I can actually animate the MetaHuman inside Unreal, and then adding Deep Face Live right on top of that. <laughs> now, obviously, this is pretty crazy technology, and it's, it's just like an experiment, and who knows what the future is going to hold as far as technology goes. I'm pretty excited about this technology, so y'all can tell because I've been making videos about it. But yeah, I'm going to keep messing around with this because I think it's pretty cool, and honestly, this technology is just going to get better and better. What do y'all think about this crazy setup with a face good helmet driving a meta human and then deep faking on top of it? It's like the meta human inception, an animation within an animation without an animation. It's pretty crazy, but I think it's pretty cool. Let me know in the comments below what you think. See ya.